Good morning, all of you. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning. This is Dr. Nesar. Welcome you once again in the online lecture series of artificial intelligence and the robotics. This is our lecture number five, and today we are going to continue with our yesterday's session where we are discussing what is meant by the state space search and the artificial intelligence as the problem solver. Okay. yesterday already we have discussed why we are referring the artificial intelligence as a problem solver as already i told you we are using the artificial intelligence to address various kind of real world problems yes or no yes sir which are the real world problems being addressed by the artificial intelligence yes which are the real world problems being addressed by or being addressed with the help of the artificial intelligence yes all of you got the question all of you got the question or should i repeat yes sir repeat kar what i am asking tell me the various kind of real world problems being addressed by or being solved by with the help of the artificial intelligence hmm yes Roini yes do you understand the question which are the real world problems being solved with the help of the artificial intelligence hmm yes roini Yes sir. Do you understand the question? Yes sir. Ah, uh, tell me the answer. What I ask? Sir, real world pro problems which is hmm. solved by AI. Ah, hmm. ah, uh, uh, yes. Which are that? Uh, I have just asked the question in the different way. The answer so of that already. Gaming and yes. uh, various kind of applications. These gaming, are nothing but the real world problems. Yes. yes. Whatever yes. we have Which seen, like. Which is useful like, for uh, human. Yes, like uh, we have seen uh, in the music sector, playing the music with the help yes. of the artificial intelligence instead of the human being as a musician. Be the, yes or no? That business is industries. Human. Business industries, voice technology, then the. Yes. in the military sector for example for uh, bomb disposal etc etc so these all yes, applications are nothing but what all applications of the artificial intelligence are nothing but for human beings these are nothing but the real world problems yes or no yes sir and to solve yes, these sir. real world problems we are taking the help of what artificial artificial intelligence, intelligence. understood so that's why we are calling the artificial intelligence as a problem solver understood and there are uh, yesterday from yesterday we were discussing there are the various techniques or the methods being utilized to solve this kind of problems and one of that from yesterday we were discussing that is nothing but what state space search technique understood now let's continue with the further part of search. the states state space search now yesterday already we have discussed what is meant by the state space search etc etc 
I hope all of you got the concept of what is meant by the state space search. What is meant by the state space search? Yes. What is meant by the state space search? Sonal. State space search is what? Yes, sir, anybody? Huh. Yes. State space search means uh, uh, finding the exact position and uh, fix them. Okay. Anybody else? Sir, we can sir. say we are finding the empty space for uh, uh, for making some to enter something else in that space. Like we are making a goal set for it. Okay. Yes. Anybody else? Uh, searching the empty space for movement. So searching within a searching within a given state space, so that we can reach to the goal state. Understood. So that is nothing but what state space search. Understood. Search. State space is nothing but the certain area where we are doing the searching. Understood. So terms related with that already yesterday we have studied. And we are carrying with the same example. That is the example of what solving the eight puzzle problem. Okay, which problem we are trying to solve? Eight puzzle problem. Problem. Okay. Now related with that next part we have various steps in the solving the problem. Okay, what various steps in the solving the problem? Now one thing problem. here. Here you should keep in mind. Now the artificial intelligence is solving the problem for us. Okay, artificial intelligence is solving the problem uh, for us. So that's why to that problem solver we are referring the artificial the artificial agent. Okay, understand this part. What what is mean by the artificial agent? The artificial intelligence solving problem for us and to that entity who is solving problem for us we are calling it as what the agent or the artificial agent for example if if the ai player is playing the chess then we are calling that ai player as what artificial agent player understood yes sir here from from here onwards you have to take the meaning of agent is nothing but the artificial intelligence entity Got the point? Okay. You have to take the meaning of yes. agent here is what? The artificial intelligence entity. For example, uh, entity. if you are using the robot in the industry sector, then that robot is nothing but your AI agent. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Yes. yes sir. So from here onwards, you have to take the meaning of agent as an artificial entity who is trying to solve the problem. Okay. Now here, these are nothing. First, before we actually solve the problem uh, with the help of the state space search technique, before that we need to understand which are the different steps in the solving the problem. Okay, in that state, different kind of steps. First step is the identification of problem and analyzing the problem. What do what do we mean by the identification of problem and analyzing the problem? Okay. Now here, what kind of problem we are trying to solve? Our example, Pankaj, what kind of problem we are trying to solve in this example? Yes. Eight puzzle problem. Eight puzzle problem. We are trying trying to solve what? Eight puzzle problem. Understood. Now consider the example. For example, human being. Human being want to play the game. Okay, one human being want to play the game. For example, chess. Now, for some new player, for some new player to play the game, what are the things are what what different things are necessary? Some new player is there, and he want to play the chess. Correct, human being. Now, what what are the things? Required for him to play the chess game. Master 
That is my question. Rules might be he should know the rules. Means he should know about how to play the chase. Yes or no? Game. Yes. That chase game. How to play that chase game? So that is nothing but for human being also. That is nothing but what identification of problem. Yes or no? Yes, sir. First, that player should should have to know how to play that game. What are the rules to play that game? That is nothing but what identification of the problem. Once he know how to play the game, then he can do more analysis on that rules or not. Up yes, now, once he knows about the rules of the game, how to play, etc., etc., then he can do the analysis of that problem. What do you mean by the analysis of that yes. problem? Analyzing the problem is what means. Then he can make his own strategy. Yes. How to play? Yes, sir. After he know the yes. rules, then he can make his own strategy. That is nothing but what analyzing, analyzing the, the problem. analyzing okay. the problem. Understood this point? Identification yes, sir. of problem and analyzing the problem. Okay. Now same thing is there for the artificial agent also. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Same thing. Same thing can be applied for the artificial agent. Correct. Yes, sir. So yes, sir. that is the reason. First step in the solving the problem is nothing but what analyzing and the defining the problem. Okay. Understood. The first step is what identify what exactly problem is. For example, if you want to play the eight puzzle game, then you need to understand what what exactly that eight puzzle game is. What are the rules to play that? What are the rules to uh, winning situation? Correct. So that is nothing but the first step. That is the identification of problem and analyzing the problem. Because if the problem understood incorrectly, okay, listen carefully. If the problem understood incorrectly, then will that problem will be get solved or not? You got the question. All of you got the question. Or shall I repeat? If the, if the problem is understood, something which is different than the actual problem, somebody might be something Somebody's mic is on. Okay, I repeat the statement. If the problem is understood, something which is different than the actual problem, then what will happen? Yes. So problem solving is very difficult. If the problem which is understood incorrectly, then what will be the result of that? Will the problem will get solved correctly? No, sir. No, no, no sir. Problem solve नहीं होगा और कोई और चीज़ नहीं आएगी. अगर अगर आपने गेम खेलने के जो रूल से वो अच्छी तरह से you if you don't if you don't understand that rules correctly, yes. Then will that will you able to play that game? No. No, and even sir. and even if you try to play that game, you will definitely lose. Correct or not? Yes, sir. And yes, that sir. is the reason. First step is the very much important. That is the identification of the problem and analyzing the problem. First step, Kali, sir, I am. Yes, sir. Yes. 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 Yes.
represent that problem with the help of what state space, state space. correct or not yes. after identifying the problem yes. you have to represent that problem with the help of the some data structure as a state space and that is i have written here convert the problem statement into the state space where the state space is what the collection of the all the possible valid state that agent can reside that agent can reside means where, which agent can utilize or where agent can make their entries understood so what exactly the uh, state space that already yesterday i told you this is nothing but the this is nothing but the representation of eight puzzle problem this is nothing but what representation of eight puzzle problem with the help of the state space correct all of you able to see yes yes sir. this is nothing but yes, what sir. representation of our eight puzzle problem using the state space and that is nothing but our second step all of you understood the second step yes sir representation yes. of your problem using the state space then third third step is what gathering the knowledge means what now agent want to solve the problem correct yes sir. agent want to solve the problem you know to solve the problem he has to gather some information yes or no yes sir yes. that is nothing but the gathering the knowledge which is required by agent to solve the current problem, problem. problem. now from where he can get the knowledge can anybody able to tell me from where he can get that knowledge so past experience yes programming one, one which thing is, is what past experience, past experience and another thing is what the pre embedded knowledge what do you mean by the pre embedded knowledge in the system yes. means what जोजेंट don't become initially only the expert he has to be play some games related with what if you are if you are taking the example of eight puzzle he has to play the, that eight puzzle games number of times accordingly he will get the experience and then he will become the perfect player who can defeat the human being also correct or not yes sir that's why the that is the meaning of knowledge it has gathered through the past experience all of you got the third step yes sir gathering yes, the sir. knowledge next, sir. next is the planning planning means which is being also referred as the relevant control strategy yes here i have written the problem may not be always the isolated problem isolated in the sense the problem cannot be a single problem only within that problem there might be the another problem also yes sir correct or not so yes. according to the problems that agent trying to solve he has to make some planning that planning is nothing but he has to make some control strategies for example if you take this part here here you can see after agent after agent from this initial state goes to the next state from this in, uh, initial state it goes to the next state now he has got how many states here three states correct three. one yes. two and three now from here which state to utilize whether this to utilize or this to utilize or this that is nothing but the that has to be decided by whom ai agent or not yes ai agent barobar consider you as a one human player you are playing against the another player but that another player is not the human that another player is what that is the ai player correct so that ai player has to decide 
now he he should explore this state or this state or this state that is nothing but the control strategy he has to apply here whether he use this state this state or the this state that is nothing but the planning correct or not yes planning understood now this was the one single problem initially after that you have, you have got the this as a one problem this has a one problem this has a one problem correct or not yes sir so within a single problem there come the number of problems and that's why he has to make the planning here he has to make the control strategy now how he will play next using this state or this state or this state so in order to decide that the ai player has to do some planning that is we are also referring it as a he has to utilize some relevant control strategy so that he must decide before attempting to solve the further problem understood the fourth step that is nothing yes, but sir. what planning which is being nothing but also called as a control strategy okay strategy. let's go to the next step that is the identification of solution and choosing the solution now we tell me about this so optimal solution apan kal bagit now hota. now you can get more than one solution yes sir you can get more than one yes, solution sir. yes now out of that out of that multiple solution present you need to so it is need to check all the solution and you have to take one out of that that is nothing but yes, what sir. identification of solution and choosing the solution understood these steps solution fifth step yes, understood sir. yes and lastly yes. after performing all these step last is nothing but then implementation that implementation. is what after all gathering of knowledge after doing all planning the strategies the knowledge should be apply and the plan should be executed in a systematic way so as to reach to which state goal state goal state understood so this yes, using these different steps that we have seen from the starting like we have seen first one was identification and analyzing the problem second representation state of state. that problem using the state space third gathering the knowledge fourth do the planning fifth identification of solution and choosing one solution out of that and last one is nothing but applying whatever knowledge you have gathered with the help of some that is nothing but the part of your implementation so that you can so that you in the sense ai agent can reach to the goal state all of you got the steps involving the solving the problem yes sir yes sir. okay now let's move to the next part related with the state space sir that is nothing but problem formulation which is nothing but our first step in the solving the problem what was our first step in the solving the problem identification, identification. of problem and analyzing the problem correct yes. so problem formulation is nothing but what same thing analyzing and defining the problem understood here i have written before we jump to finding the algorithm or applying the algorithm evaluating the problem and searching for the solution we first need to define and formulate the problem problem understood so general sequence followed by the simple problem solving agent is nothing but first it should formulate the problem that is what it should define the problem and analyze the problem with what goal he has to reach what is its initial state and which state it has to be reach then and then only it search for the sequence of action that would solve the problem and execute the action at a time in short before we apply some searching algorithm or before the ai agent apply the searching algorithm to solve some problem first thing is important that is nothing but what problem formulation and problem formulation is nothing but what defining and analyzing the problem that is simply the meaning of or that is simply the concept of what problem formulation understood so problem formulation include the deciding what action to be performed and which state to be considered and this has to be done at each state of your problem solving 
until you reach to the goal state okay let me show you in the diagram problem formulation is nothing but at now if if the agent is at this state now agent must able to decide now at this state what action to be performed at this state what action to be performed at this state what action to be performed understood and out of these which state he should consider whether this state whether this state or whether this state to perform the action now can you able to tell me out of these three states on which state action has been performed here so yesterday you told you told that the one state is uh, possible that the goal state one state one element uh, at least one element is the same in the goal state and that uh, strategy we will apply there and we will choose the out of three one is correct no no i am asking ai agent now how many states are generated after the first state here three state three yes sir three. what i am asking out of these three states which state is chosen by the ai agent to perform the action second second is this state. one second second yes, three so this this state is chosen by the ai agent to perform the action so these things in the, these all things comes under the problem formulation what action to be performed and which state to be decide to perform the action these all the things can comes under the point of what if all the things can comes under the point of the problem formulation okay so once the problem form formulation get completed then and then only the problem solution steps will be carry on to solve certain problems okay now there are certain there are certain what you can say there are certain there are different uh, what you can say different uh, steps in the form problem formulation that has to be follow okay and that is our next point the different components of the problem formulation understood now there are five main components are there in the problem formulation okay in that first one is the initial state so initial state is which state initial state the first state okay in as if you want to see the in figure this is here which is our initial state this is our initial state here i have written so first component in the problem formulation is what initial state initial state okay initial state. then let's go to the uh, second uh, step in the problem formulation that is the action second step in the problem formulation is what action means on that particular state which action to be performed understood for example on the initial state initially which action to be performed that is the second component of the problem formulation that is the action it is the set of action that can be executed or applicable in all possible states let me take you to the figure again here on each of these state this initial state and state you are getting after that on each of this one this one this one this one like all the states which action to be performed that is nothing but our second component in the problem formulation then the third important one third component successor function or which is being also called as the transition model now focus here what is actually mean by the successor function it is the function that return a state on executing an action on the current state what it is what it is the function that returns a state on executing an action on the current state that is nothing but called as what the your successor function understood let me take you the diagram once again here once you perform 
once you perform action on this state after that which state you are going to get that is nothing but what your transition model or that is nothing but your successor function all of you got the successor function what i am telling once you perform the action on certain state for example here you perform action on this state now after performing the action on this state which state you get that is nothing but what your successor function or that is nothing but your what transition model understood yes yes or no success successor function manje kay tumhi jar ya state var action perform keli tumhi in the sense ai agent ni tyachanantar tumhala je state milta that is nothing but what successor successor function after applying the after performing the action on this state you are getting how many states here three state three state that is called as what the successor function function got the point yes. then the fourth component in the problem formulation that is the goal, goal test means what kon yes what is the goal test we have to do final test hmm goal test goal test. test means testing whether you have reached to the final uh, testing whether you have reached to the goal state or not no, for that purpose what is being done goal testing is goal being test. done now how the goal testing is being done so maybe checking the element that present in the goal state and current state we compare that yes you have to compare condition. you have to compare okay. the current state you and have to compare what state. the current state and the goal state, goal state. suppose you are now, your current state is this okay now you have to compare okay. this state with your goal state. goal state whether these two states are similar these no. and these similar or not no no means goal test fail here yes sir goal test fail or not yes sir yes sir again if you compare this this state with this state goal test fail or will succeed 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 because this state is similar to the this state and that is nothing but the fourth component of the problem formulation that is what the goal, goal test goal okay test. now in the goal test also there are the two kinds of testing being done okay in that one is the explicit goal test and another is the implicit, implicit goal, goal test. test now here you just understood what exactly that mean i will show you in the example uh, what is mean by the explicit goal test and what is mean by the implicit goal test here implicit means goal test is carried out by comparing the current state with the defined goal state goal. that now i i show you correct yes, the yes, testing sir. the testing i now shown you that is nothing but called as what the explicit explicit goal test goal test, goal test. now what is mean by the implicit now in case of the explicit goal test you already you already know what is what will be your goal state correct but in yes, in case of the implicit implicit goal testing you never used to know what will be your goal state got the point yes sir here explicit means you are comparing your current state with the defined goal state let me take you the diagram once again explicit means what you are comparing your current state for example this is your current state with what you are comparing this current state goal state because you know about the goal state correct yes sir but there are some problem there are some problem where you don't know about the goal state goal state in yes, that sir. case in that case the testing which is being done that is called as what the implicit, implicit. goal test goal test 
understood now let me yes. let me take you to the more simplified example of explicit goal test and the implicit goal test now before we uh, see the this example of implicit explicit and the implicit goal test uh, we have the last component of the problem formulation that is what path cost path cost it is being it is being calculated with the help of the cost function and it is what it is simply the cost associated with each step taken to reach to the goal goal state, state. that is nothing but your path cost understood so yes. this is nothing but all the this all the components formulate the problem yes the so problem formulation is done using all these five components got the point yes sir yes now let me clear the what i told you what what exactly man mean by the uh, your ex example of the explicit goal test here i have shown you the example of tic tac toe game i hope all of you must be knowing about the tic tac toe game yes sir tic tac toe game means what where uh, somebody if the somebody able to make the vertical horizontal, horizontal. vertical or the diagonal combination of same symbol for example x or o oh. then that particular player is declared as a winning player yeah. as a winning state i have mentioned here understood now yes sir related with the tic tac toe before you start playing the game you already know what you know ki when you are going to win means what 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 situation what state will be there which will declare you as a winning player what what state will be there if you vertical place all the player. x vertically or if you place all the x horizontally or if you place all the x diagonally in that case you come to know that you have won that game yes or no yes sir but think about the chase about the related with the chase will you able to tell me predefinedly yes or no will you able to tell me the goal state no sir no karan no, no, no. chase madhe kay asto chase madhe ek scenario tayar hoto in the hmm. chase one yes. scenario get created ha scenario tumhi game chalu hoycha agodar sangu shakta ka no nahi no. this kind of scenario in case of the chase you cannot you cannot tell before starting the game but in case of the tic tac toe you can tell or not yes 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 in case of the tic tac toe you can easily tell sir if i get all the symbols horizontally vertically or the diagonally in that case i will won but that is not the situation in case of the chase game and that's why this chase is nothing but the example of implicit goal test correct Hmm. Yes, sir. And yes, sir. tic tac toe is nothing but what example of explicit explicit, explicit, explicit in the sense where the goal state is pre already known predefined and implicit means we don't know goal about the state. goal state goal you have state. you have to form that particular scenario in certain you have to reach to that certain situation or you have to reach to that certain scenario. and that that scenario will decide whether you have reached to the goal state or goal not. state not. not now i hope all of you yes sir okay so up till we have seen different steps in the solving the problem which can be utilized by the artificial intelligence problem solver that is the ai agent and then we have seen how the problem get formulate okay and how the problem get formulate with the help of the components of the problem formulation and in that we have seen in that we have seen five components okay in that we have seen the five components which are that which are the five components initial state Initial state, initial state, action, 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 action,
Cold test and lastly the path cost. Path cost. Now let me take you to the example. Okay, where you formulate the eight puzzle. This is the question being asked number of times for the eight marks or the ten marks. Formulation of eight puzzle problem. For your kind information. This is the most important part, which is being asked in the exam number of times. Explain the formulation of eight puzzle problem. Okay. I hope all of you can able to see this particular uh, diagram. Okay. Now in this, I have mentioned. I have mentioned some parameters. Okay. Here I have mentioned some parameters. Like I have mentioned the parameter as a G. All of you able to see? Yes. Yes. Sir. Then I have mentioned the parameter as a H. F and F. And I have mentioned another parameter as a F. F. Okay. Now there is a first we understand what exactly mean by these parameters, and then we will try to apply that. So first one is the G. It indicates the state number. It indicates what state, state at which at which state level the AI agent is now at the current situation. H indicates the number of displaced tiles. Means what? H indicates the number of displaced tiles. Yeah, that answer is good. Switch off the mic. What do you want the number of displaced tiles? The tiles when you say what do you want the tiles? Here is a empty place. Here is a place. Here. This is also called as a tiles. Tiles. The but this is the empty tiles. This is a fill tile. Understood. And meaning of H is what the number of displaced. Tiles, understood. And lastly, the way of the function f equal to g plus h, f equal to g plus g h. h, which indicates the cost function. Cost function. Which indicate what the cost function. Okay. All of you understood the parameters. G, yes, sir. Yes, sir. H and the f. 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 Okay. Now we will apply here. C. First is the initial state. So what is your initial state? Can you able to see? Yes, sir. Your initial state configuration. What is your initial state configuration? One, two, three. One, two, three. three. Then zero, four, six. Empty, empty tile. I am referring the empty tile by the zero. Yes, sir. So your second yes. zero four six, six, six and six, third six, third row seven, seven five, five eight. eight. So this is nothing but first step in the problem formulation. That is the initial state. Initial state. Samajh le? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Then come to the actions. Then actions. Now in case of the different games. The action will be different or not? Yes, yes sir. sir. Correct. Here we are referring the action related with the eight puzzle problem. Now, in the eight puzzle problem, consists of the four main action. That is the left, right, right, up, and, and the down. down. This is nothing but the second actions. Action. Understood. Third is the successor function. Function. Successor function is what? successor function which will give you the successive state current. yes sir. which will give you the successive state from the current state yes or no yes sir so here for example also i have shown you if we apply down action see carefully if we apply down action to the start state what if we apply 
down to the start state the resulting state has the one and the blank switching their positions observe it read it and observe it all of you are observing yes sir this is your starting state or the initial state yes sir now we start solving the problem you know to solving the problem which action you apply down down down, down means what this this which we are having the empty space here yes sir down means this one will be shifted down you got the meaning of down yes sir meaning of down is what this one will be get shifted down correct now what will be the result of this one will be shifted down if this one will be get shifted down this will become empty yes sir and on the place of empty what will be get replace one yes or no yes sir empty empty place this was the empty place empty place after you perform the down action the empty place will be replaced by the one and the one will be replaced by the empty space correct yes sir yes sir that yes, is sir. nothing but the successor function mm -hmm. correct yes sir when you apply some action and when you get the next the another state that is nothing but the result of your successor successor function, function. now you tell me which action has been performed here down so one again move to the upward side and four to the left side miss which action you tell me the action i would have four four left lagela hai sir hmm four is four go to the left four left lag means here you have performed the action here first you have performed the action here that's why go you got this state then again you yes, perform so second same. action here but what is that action you are perform the act blank first switching their position Left you got the one. first you got the first scenario yes where yes, we have yes. where you have perform the which action down down that's why you got this state so mm -hmm. we perform the action there so here which action which second action will for will need to perform you so that you get this state so firstly you say one upon khali hetla na khali up karav lagil ani mang to four ikade left la ghetay nahi nahi he yacha ni yacha kai sambandh nahi ito tumhi apan action kutle state var apply karto initial state var barobar ka if you apply on the initial state down this one comes to the this uh, on the place of empty space now here if you apply left action correct yes yes left action tumhala kuta perform karaychi itha jar tumhi ya state la left action perform keli tar kay hoil tumcha jo ha 4 hai to ikde hi ya position la hil correct and this empty space will go to the this place and that's that is the result correct yes sir now you tell me which action you to perform on the initial state so that you will get this state up you need to perform seven. the up. Up. up up if you perform the yes, up seven. here this hmm. number will up go to the side yeah. and this empty space will correct yes sir so that is nothing but your yes. successor function applying the action on the certain state and getting the resulting state all of you got the yes, successor sir. function yes sir all yes, of sir. you got uh, got the point of actions yes sir yes, yes now yes, let's sir. let's move forward to the next component that is the goal test what goal test goal now test. you have got the three different state after performing correct yes sir upon uh, we have perform how many action on the initial state Three. 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 Correct. Uh, what yes, what action? Up, left, and down. Up, down. 
डाउन ऑफ हाँ यस डाउन ऑफ लेफ्ट एक्शन वे आप परफॉर्म करेक्ट एंड एज आई सेड आफ्टर यू परफॉर्म द एक्शन एंड यू गेट द स्टेट एवरी टाइम यू हैव टू परफॉर्म व्हाट एवरी टाइम यू हैव टू परफॉर्म द गोल टेस्ट गोल टेस्ट नाउ इफ यू अप्लाई द गोल टेस्ट ऑन दिस first state this state this state this state and the this state whether our goal test will be successful or the fail fail now our goal test will be fail he he je dakhole tumhala he last he last state dakholeli hai don't think about this now yes sir correct we yes, will go step by step if you apply goal test to this state or to this state or to this state our yes. result will definitely going to be what our result will be going to be definitely the fail fail understood yes sir now accordingly accordingly then we move forward okay and there comes our cost function and there comes now we have got three states here now you know to move forward how the ai agent will move forward because we have to move, the ai agent has to be move forward because he has not reached to the goal state correct mm. then how the ai agent will move forward and on the basis of what the ai agent will move forward okay so related with let me let me tell you related with this state g is equal to how much zero h is how much 3 Now, how this three comes? I forget to tell you. Can anybody able to tell me how this three come? What what I have told you regarding the H? Tiles, sir. H number is what? Tiles. Not or not not just the number of tiles. H is what? Number. Yes, of number of displays. Display tiles. Tiles. Correct. Tiles. Now, what do you mean by these three? Then means it indicates there are how many tiles are displays? Three. Three tiles. Correct. How many tiles? Yes, three sir. tiles. Is it correct or not? Yes, sir. Correct, how you sir. decide how many tiles are the displays? Goal states comparison goal. After the Kaya Karawala gel, he just tumchi initial state eh. ये जी तुमची इनिशियल स्टेट है बरोबर दिस स्टेट यू हैव टू कंपेयर विद द गोल स्टेट यस करेक्ट नाउ इफ यू कंपेयर दिस विद द गोल टेस्ट द गोल स्टेट देन यू कैन सी 1 2 3 1 2 फर्स्ट रो इज करेक्ट 1 2 3 इज आल्सो देयर करेक्ट यस बट इन केस ऑफ आवर गोल स्टेट हियर इज अ 4 बट हियर इज अ एम्प्टी स्पेस Yes, sir. Means this is the first display style. Yes, yes. or no? Five, six. Yes, sir. Five here, six is six. here, six is here also. Yes. Correct. Here we need the five. Yes. Here, what is four? This is the second display style. Yes. Yes sir. or no? Yes. Yes. Here is the seven. Here is the seven. Here is the eight, but here is the what five? Five. Five. This is the third display styles. Yes, yes sir. Yes, that's why yes, I'm. Sir. That's why I'm saying. That's why h is equal to how much? Three. Three. In order three. to get three. the display styles, you have to compare this initial state with the final state. Goal state, state. state. initially. <laughs> I'm. I'm telling you this in your initially. Understood. When you move forward, every time. when you move forward every time you have to compare the current state with the goal state goal if state. if this is your current state now you have to compare with the goal state then you get the value of h if you h. if you add this state you have to compare this state with the goal state then you will get the value of h if you are at this state currently you have to compare this state with the goal state and then you will get the value of h correct or h. not yes yes and now you tell me whether this h equal to 4 is correct or not for this state what you have to do 
you have to compare this state with the goal state correct yes sir correct correct sir correct, correct, sir. correct, 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 correct yes sir afterwards you focus on that and check all these things correct yes sir yes. now you understood the second parameter next is the third f equal to g plus h Yes, that is sir. the cost function that you have to evaluate no, you in the sense ai agent has to evaluate this at each state regarding the first initial regarding the first state f equal to g plus h g is hot zero h is what three that's why f three. f is equal to how much three. Three. three correct same calculation you have to perform regarding the this state also same calculation you have to perform regarding this state also and regarding this state also correct yes sir now related with this what is the cost related with this what is the cost and related with this what is the cost you tell me related with this state what is the cost 5 sir 5 related with five, this how much 3 3 and related three. with this how much five. Five, five. Which is the less five. cost out of three? Say middle. Middle, middle one. Is, middle one is having the less cost, and that's why yes, the AI agent will prefer this state to do the okay. next movement. Correct? Okay. Yes. I, yesterday I told you. Now, yes. how to select the states out of number of state is being chosen with the help of which function? cost function understood cost function now again you apply the that operation that i told you action that i told you which action left right up left. down yes which action left right left right up, up down. down that is depends on intelligence of that ai agent correct okay and that is the reason he has apply some action and he has got now the Again, three states he has got. See here. Initially, your G was zero. When you go to the next level, your G becomes one. When you go to the next level, your G becomes two. Correct? Two. Now, when you reach to this intermediate level, again, this all calculation has to be done. Okay? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Then again, you got the value of G H F. Yes. yes. Sir. Now, which function you apply to go to proceed? First. Cost function First. you apply, and then you will First. see the less cost is of this state. Mm -hmm. yes, That's why you will choose this state. AI agent will choose yes. this state to make the further movement. Yes, sir. Then, yes, according sir. to his intelligence, he apply two actions here. Which two actions applied here? Right and down. Right and right down. Right down. and down. Right down. Yes. Down. Right and down. Yes, sir. Right and down or the right or left? Right, right to left. Right and left. This state is the this state is the result of which action? Right, sir. Huh? Left, 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 left. 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 Yes, your left apply karna correct. If you apply left mm -hmm. here, this eight will be get shifted here. Yes, sir. And then again, you have to perform all the calculation. You in the sense the AI agent. So you will get the G as the three, H is two, F as five. Here also G as the three, uh, uh, H uh, zero. Uh, yeah, zero. H will be zero regarding the goal state. Because there is a no misplaced yes, time, and f is a three, and yes, here cost for which is having the less cost, definitely this, and three. even you can compare this state with the goal state, and you can also compare this state with the goal state. Cost you will get the result here that this state and the these states are matching with each other, and from that the AI, AI agent will decide now he has reach. To the goal state. Understood. And here we have solved your eight puzzle problem. Eight puzzle problem. Understood. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So your yes, solution to the problem is nothing but the sequence of action chosen by the problem solving agent. Who is your problem solving agent? AI agent. AI the agent. That lead from the initial state to the goal state. Goal state. I hope all of you understood the eight puzzle problem formulation and the concept of state space search. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. All of you need to go through the video again. I will upload this. Okay. Yes, sir. And then you can ask me the doubts in the comment section. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. This is the quote for you today. You can't have a better tomorrow if you are still thinking about the yesterday. Yes, sir. Means it doesn't mean that what you have learned yesterday, you have to forget that. That is not the thing. <laughs> Correct. Thank you, sir. Understood. Yes, yes, sir. Okay. If you have done, so if you have some bad things happen from you yesterday or you have wasted time yesterday, that kind of things you have to forget. And focused on the tomorrow. Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. So that's it from my side today. Thank you, all of you. Shall I conclude? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Don't don't go anywhere. I have to take the attendance. Don't go anywhere. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you all of you. Thank you, Thank you sir. Thank you, Thank you sir. sir.